Okay, Chris, I want to start with you because I saw you even going with the with the music. So how many times have you seen this trailer? I mean, we've been working on it. So, and, and every time I go... It's, it's just the director in me. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So tell me a bit more about it. What motivated um, a, a film? I mean, we, we do have a few films that talk about that. But looking at South Africa and the artists that we keep losing to things such as suicide, etc., that's what I think of when I think of the movie Tando. Yeah, uh, suicide is a big is a big issue, not just in artists. You know, we just stand out because then we're in the public space. But suicide, there's a lot of kids who are taking their own lives uh, daily, and you know, it's now becoming a pandemic. Mm. And we we just created a film to just you know try and bring hope to the teenagers as well, and but also to create a conversation between parents. And, and, and their kids, you know. Masako, imagine sitting in this room and as a parent and you don't know, Hore, in the other room your child is actually cutting themselves or your child is literally why hanger. Mm. That's, that's what we are doing. Let's, let's bridge that gap. And that gap is so small. Yeah. All you have to do, open the door and have a conversation. And have a conversation with your yeah. kid. I mean, I know that we're going from, uh, you know, saying this film is about things that are depressing and helping parents, uh, you know, get to understand and know their children. But yeah. you have been recognized. How does that feel, um, being recognized for this particular film? Yes, yes. I think, <clears throat> on our side, that's a great, uh, you know, we, we won four international awards mm. uh, at the Audi World Film Festival in L.A. So I think that was good because also we got the main award, which was the best of festival. And uh, that just shows that out of all the movies that have come out, this actually touched a lot of stories. And it just says that the story is not only about a South African story, mm. but it touches the globe as, as well. You know, it has global impact. We dealt with issues <clears throat> in there that were about more edu education. How do you educate your kids? What type of conversation is supposed to be having with your kids? How do you be social aware of your surroundings and everything that goes around you? And more importantly, we bring hope. We yeah. bring hope. Yeah. <laughs> so that was the main thing, because everybody said, hey, we're doing depressing stories and mm. stuff like that. And I said, no, this is not depressing. This is about bringing hope, that mm. we can change the narrative. And I think that's what uh, we are claimed for. And, then, uh, and yeah, I think it's a good thing that we actually took those four international awards. Mm. So hopefully yeah. there's more. Yeah, there's <laughs> more. Rashida, tell me about some yeah. of the challenges that you faced as a producer, yeah. not just about, you know, being the boss on set, etc., but in terms of some of the scenes that you would see and yeah. the emotional toll that it would take <clears> on you. Yeah, yeah. So I read the story a hundred times before <laughs> we started shooting. Yeah. My story? And I, uh, no, 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 in terms of Tando. Oh, uh, I yes, see. Okay. in terms of thunder. So mm. before the script, I mean, we put it together. Mm. We're sitting under a tree. We told the story, and then we just pictured it at how we wanted it to come out. Mm. But COVID was the challenge, you know. So we couldn't do the usual things where we could run in the streets, change locations. We had to go. We we're working in a controlled environment, and I think that's what held us, you know. So are we going to put this powerful story during COVID? Yeah. Mm. And also, it became about the cast that we have to now select uh, and the crew. You know, we always say the crew that we had to put together. We had to put together a shop crew, we had to get a talented cast that everybody knew that, look, we've got set times and we have to put, pull this thing off mm -hmm. in the period that we wanted to pull it in. And also budgetary constraints. It was COVID, nobody had money, and uh, we had to come up with the money. We had to <laughs> take money out of our own pockets and said, but we put it together. And I think the teamwork was excellent, you know. I'll do it again with the same team. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, Kaka, so tell me, you, you play a character in the movie. You produce as well at the same time. I was I always, just forced, I, uh, man. I was forced to do this thing. <laughs> really? Yeah, I'm, 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 I'm directing. And I mean, when Russia is talking about some of the you know, challenges that we had, and mm. we had an actor just drop us on the day. Oh. And so I had to jump in, and I was like this side, and then I went back, and then I had to watch myself. Tyler Perry. <laughs> Literally, on the verge of. literally, I had to, yeah. Yeah, but tell me about, um, you know, I always, I often wonder when I see uh, actors and actresses portray characters of, uh, you know, of importance like that, yeah. uh, you know, uh, that, that would possibly, because you've, you've got a huge platform in society, people look at you and yeah. you could be giving somebody hope, maybe somebody's going through exactly what that character is going through. Mm -hmm. Tell me about the difficulty and, um, you know, the advice for actors and actors and actresses to know the power that you have yo look uh i i grew up in this space and you know just as a as a director uh i always say that i mean I, i'm directing on house of zita now and i always say guys you gotta remember there's five point 
two million people who are watching you. Mm -hmm. And even when we are directing, we have to make sure that we tell the story right. We have to make sure that we make it authentic. We have to make sure mm -hmm. that we touch lives and change lives and bring hope. That's what it's about. Mm -hmm. You know, uh, we've got a huge audience. And this film is also going to have, I mean, a huge audience. Right. Uh, we're looking at the numbers now. Uh, we've been going around schools, you know, uh, making sure that, you know, SGBs are coming in on board. Uh, the department is also coming on board. So we're going to have... We're going to have big numbers when it comes to this. And we're hoping that with those big numbers, we are able to touch their lives and bring hope to the kids. Yeah. Mm. So you won international awards. Do you think that South Africa still has a lot to work on in terms of appreciating our own before they appreciate it outside? <clears throat> yeah. So there, there, there's still a lot to work on. I think our criteria is still a bit uh, stringent. And maybe that's for good reason, because what it does then, it forces us to take out quality work of production. Mm. So the criteria here should be lenient, but yes, we should be, you know, acknowledging especially the, the talent that we have, you know, in the country. I think we should have more awards, have more platforms where they can be appreciated and, and the like at the festivals. We do have, I mean, there's the Durban Festival, there's, you know, we are working closely with Harting Film Commission, you know, there is a narrative, there's a new team that's on board. They're changing the rhetoric, and I think that's what we need, and that's what is happening. And it is happening. Is it moving slowly? It was moving slowly, but it has fast-tracked. Oh, I'm, I'm happy to hear that. <laughs> so where do people get to see Tando? Yeah, uh, so yeah. Yeah, nationwide. Uh -huh. Nationwide. Stay Kineko, New Metro, on the 8th of April, we go live. We're calling on the whole country to come out and watch, watch this movie. Take your family, take your friend, take that uncle. Take that yeah. guy who goes out on the weekends yeah. and uh, does the things that uh, most wouldn't want to know. <laughs> uh, get him to go watch a movie. And uh, yeah, it's of April. Yeah, let's hope the whole country. Mm. We're hoping to be in cinema. It's nationwide. Yeah. Uh, and uh, and yes, and would really and appreciate the support. We, yeah. we call on corporate to say, look, adopt a school. Yeah. Mm. You know, go out there, adopt a school, pay for them, give them that experience to go and yeah. watch the film. Uh, it's also part of their curriculum, so there's no clashes, you know, because next month, next term, uh, the part of the curriculum here, LO, yeah. is suicide and bullying. Mm. So we're saying corporate come out, buy tickets, take, take a, just a grade to, uh, to go and watch the film. That's what we're saying, yeah. Mm. Take a child to the movie. Take a yes, child to the movie. Yes, yes. Yeah. I, I think I'll probably, I'll try. With yeah. my miniature budget, yeah. I'll try ah. to adopt three <laughs> or four, <laughs> take them there, you know, yeah. and yeah. it's working, Clean. right? Yeah. Okay, so lastly, Gakhiso, just give me a message to South Africans. 21 March is Human Rights Day. Your film speaks about mm -hmm. also human rights violations. Sometimes people resort to suicide because they've been violated, things such as rape, yeah. maybe a crime that ends up having yeah. you um, have so much anxiety. Your message, how are we doing in South Africa when it comes to human rights? You know, I, I, I just think that we need to, it comes with respect and having to understand, you know, um, another person and another person's rights. And for us, you know, not to violate them, you know, and, and also to put ourselves in, in their shoes. Or, you know, if, if, if I'm a dad and I'm going to go and molest a child, you know, um, what, what, what am I doing? You know, what kind of a person do I want to be or do I want to be known for? Mm -hmm. You know, and, and I'm just saying, you know, let's respect people's rights and let's also support each other, you know, um, and, and let's give each other love and hope and be patriotic about our country as well. That's what we see when we go overseas. Yeah. You know, the Americans have a flag in, in their homes, you know, uh -huh. and, yes. and we should start having that, you know. We, yeah. we put a flag in our, in, in our homes. So yeah. we're like, listen, yeah. let's be patriotic and, and understand yeah. what that flag means. Mm. Mm -hmm. And a lot of human rights are in that flag. Well, thank you yeah, very much yeah. to the both of you. Good luck for the 8th of April. I'm yeah. sure a lot of people will go out there. Yeah. Uh -huh. And congratulations on those four international awards. Thank, thank you so you. much. Thank those you. are the producers of Tando, Kakusumudupi, as well as Rashaka Mofe.